Pittsburgh police are also investigating a home invasion. This one happened this morning in Mount Oliver. And as Megan Sheila reports, police say that the intruder was armed and so was the homeowner. Investigators tell us that the homeowner had a handgun and shot the intruder. Neighbors we talked with said they're surprised that they didn't even hear anything overnight. Just after 5 Thursday morning, police say someone called 911. In response to 911 calls about a home invasion in progress. Uh, when they uh, arrived, they found the homeowner uh, had shot and wounded the potential burglar. Mount Oliver police cars and yellow crime tape blocked off the intersection of Sherman and Stam Avenues. The homeowner was the person who called 911 and was very cooperative with the officers. The victim or the actor, the burglar, was pronounced dead at the scene. A half dozen or so people stood behind the crime tape in the rain and watched as detectives walked in and out of the home. He was found in possession of a uh, uh, weapon similar to an assault rifle. We saw officers take two men to headquarters, including the man who police say killed the intruder. The Allegheny County Medical Examiner said the intruder didn't have any identification on him, so they can't yet release his name. Usually we would hear a sound. If there was a bullet or something, we would hear it inside. Didn't hear anything. Neighbor Irene McGuire said she thinks renters live in the home, but she's never met them since they moved in a few months ago. A lot of people say, Aren't you afraid living here? And I say, No, I'm really not because my neighbors are good neighbors and the police are excellent. They do an excellent job. If you call, they're here within minutes. I mean, so I don't know. I'm shocked. This, this is shocking for me to see that something happened right in, in front of my house. And since most of the neighbors told detectives that they didn't hear anything, they are asking for people to call the county tip line if you know of anything that possibly led to this home invasion. Reporting in Mount Oliver, I'm Megan Schiller, KDKA TV News.